folks. Well, here we are at, coming up on the Super Bowl and uh, I'm gonna make some chili today. It's Saturday the day before and let that sit overnight <clears throat> in the fridge and really soak up the flavors. I'm using the brisket chili recipe and I have to say it's the best, it is the best chili I've ever had. <clears throat> it's a really good recipe. So we're actually, you know, it ended up being a much bigger brisket flat. This was more like 6.8 pounds. I think last time it was, no, no, this was 8 pounds. I think the last one I have was 6 pounds, so got quite a bit more meat, but that's all right. I got a, I got a big crock pot, and uh, so if you check out the recipe, uh, I'm in the stage right now where I'm just browning the bacon, getting some fat, and then I'm going to, I'm going to brown the meat throw in the onions, get the seasonings and garlic. And then I've already got the broth and a little bit of coffee and the whole peeled tomatoes broken up. That's all in here on high and uh, we'll bring it all together. And then we're gonna cook, uh, gonna cook the mushroom soup. I did finally buy a little chamois thing to do the mesh straining. I'll use that with the mushroom soup uh, after I blend it. Uh, so this video, I'm just going to show a little bit about Super Bowl, I guess, this weekend. And then uh, I'm going to do a soda bread uh, recipe as well. And uh, so anyway, happy Super Bowl. Well, all the soup stuff's going to be coming together. I decided, in addition to the chili, which the chili, the brisket chili is looking real good. I swear that's the best chili recipe going. Um, so I'm going to boil up some clams. So I got four pounds of clams over at Blue Seafood here in Bentonville. And uh, it's got some regular bacon, some salt pork, celery, some onion, russet potatoes. Pretty straightforward recipe. I'll add a little bit of cream. I'm going to go less cream, less flour. I don't want it real thick. And uh, so we'll see how that turns out. All right, the clams have been steaming in a covered pot here for about nine minutes. They're opened up. If any didn't open, they say discard. And uh, the wife is already complaining that it smells really bad in here. All right, we got some regular bacon and some salt pork cooked up there, browned up nice. <clears throat> I'm gonna dump that over here. We, we basically took the broth, three cups, of the remaining broth from the clam, scooped it out, tried to avoid any sand and all that. Um, we got the onions and the celery and some garlic finishing up here. We'll dump that in. And then uh, got to chop up some potatoes and then also the cooked clam will take all that out cut the tummies off, squeeze the stuff out, and uh, clean it up, and we'll cut the clam meat up and put that in. All right, well, this was the uh, soda bread. It actually turned out pretty good. First time making that. A little bit of honey butter with cinnamon there. And then we had our five soups. The clam chowder turned out great. Made that with fresh clams. There was a little bit too much potatoes. I ended up putting four russets in there. I would only put maybe one or two next time. This is my mushroom soup. That turned out really good. Everybody likes that. And then I did my brisket chili again. And Gramps did his ham hock kidney bean soup. And then Sherry did the tortellini soup. So we're all in here watching the Super Bowl game here. This is the island uh, snack thing that uh, Jesse put together. It's pretty cool. Uh, Jello shots and snacks. And uh, anyway, it's been a good day.